Hey guys, it is Buddy Seven Two here, and welcome back to episode four of my Skyrim series. If anybody well watches this, I'm not sure if anyone really is. But anyway, today we will be going to visit the lovely Greybeards, which is going to be a fun little quest. So let's just sit that there, set the waypoint, so we can go follow. But first things first, I want to quickly just check that if there's any other junk that I can get rid of. So we're going to go ahead and disenchant some lovely items over here. Which I believe is this one here. I'm not really sure how to use these because I'm, I've never really done that before. Five points of frost damage. Let's learn with that one there. Destroy that. Okay. Axe of white run. We do not want that. Let's destroy that there as well. Let's destroy most things. And bows, I want to keep those there. Oh, oh I, I didn't, I didn't realise it was all my clothes I was wearing. Whoops. Please say I've got some um, appealing clothes to wear. I don't have any clothes. Whoops. <laughs> I didn't mean to get rid of all my clothes. Anyway, let's just. <laughs> Start off by running around a little bit nude, and hopefully we will come across some armor in that. It's probably not the best us having no clothes on, because we're probably going to take quite a bit of damage. I wonder if we can steal something from anywhere. I don't want to really have to do any of that type of stuff. But anyway, we should be becoming pretty light now. There we go. We've got most of the stuff gone, and hopefully I've got some equipments all equipped here if that is making any sense at all is there anything we should eat any of this stuff just to get rid of it so hopefully we have got enough potions to sustain us and hopefully we've got enough food to sustain us as well whoops didn't mean to that and let's There's let's bring out our lovely abu and then and then the square should do that there, and we can draw it away again. So now let's head away to the world. Oh, calm down, man. Hail Talos. So let's go ahead and let's quickly just jump out to this barn here. And then now let's try and work our way around to where the Greybeards live. Which, if I have a look on our map, we have got to... Oh jeez, we've got to go all the way around to this town. Ivan's dead. This, I think this is going to take a little bit of a little bit of time to get around there. But anyway, let's start our journey because I can't, I can't remember how to get there really. Most of these here are pretty good. Ivan's dead. There we go. Let's go across this bridge, and let's see what we will come across. And let's just quickly equip that there. And it should, in theory, come out, give ourselves that there. Just in case we need our bow, our axe and shield. And I see we've got a skeever just up here. So let's just, let's just kill, kill that there off. And let's continue walking around. Because it takes quite a bit of time to walk around this, in this world of Skyrim. We have got some people fighting up here. Hopefully they're not going to kill us. There's always a chance of that, but then there's always a chance there's a skeleton standing in the air. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can talk to this guy. You speak to a vigilant of Stendar. Cavort with any Daedra, and we will hunt you down. Yes. Okay. Our order was founded after the Oblivion Crisis. We dedicate our lives to facing the threat of Daedra wherever they appear. We're quartered in the Hall of the Vigilant. Keeper Carset heads Skyrim's branch of our order there, providing healing and justice as needed. I can't remember what Daedra... I should know what they are. He is the God of Mercy, the patron of order and justice for all of Tamriel. We bring his compassion where none can be found. By cleansing all those who would offend his children. You hunt Daedra? Any other abominations that prey on mortals. Vampires, werewolves. But the Daedra are the worst. Their callous disregard for our lives is abhorrent in the eyes of the God of Mercy. I'm not sure what Daedra 
Ah, I can't remember what they are. That is horrible. I should be able to remember stuff like that there, but I just can't. Is there anything, any gold or anything that we can take from you guys? Nope. Okay, let's carry on on our journey, because we're going to... So I know, I know what's got happening on, I'm just going to, I just need to continue doing that there. We've got some lovely wolves up here, let's wait for them to path find to us, or come and attack us. Go away. Stupid wolf. Okay, we don't want any of their wolf pouts, just a waste of time having to carry that there all around. And we should be... See, like, is that pointing this way, or is that pointing that way? I don't really understand it, but I'm assuming it's pointing on the path that is laid with all this cobble. So let's continue walking along this path and see what we will come across. Got some more wolves coming up here. I don't think we're meant to go up there. Let's just continue walking around and see what we will come across. Follow wolves, come on. Come and attack us. Where, where have you guys gone? Where's Lydia gone? She's really helpful, isn't she? She just disappears randomly. Are you going to catch up to me or what? Okay, let's just continue walking then. Oh, Lydia. Oh, Lydia. Let's continue walking away since Lydia does not want to come after us. Let's go round and round and round. Hello there, Mr. Stag. Okay, let's continue walking down and hopefully we come across a sign that says I've instead. I'm pretty sure it's I've instead anyway. Hopefully. We're here when we get there anyway. There we go, we come across an abandoned bridge in a tower, and it's probably, it's banded up here, so let's go ahead and let's get out our lovely sword, because they're going to probably want to try and kill us as usual. Hello. How's it going? Oh, potions are healing, I will do to say so myself. No, I want to... Let's just try and do this here. There we go. Just so I know that I do not get myself. Let's get some stamina. And yes, you did hear something, my friends. Ow. That's not nice. That's not nice. Anything useful in here? Is another one of you guys shooting up here? I think there might be one of you guys up here. No, no one's up here. Anything else around here that I can have? Oops, I didn't mean to fall down there. Anything else I can take? Oh, was that Lydia? Ow, that hurts. Ow, oh, you're very strong. You are very strong. You're very strong. <gasps> no! <laughs> Oh, I'm a coward. I'm such a coward. What did I just jump off of there for? <laughs> oh, please don't take me back to White Run. Please don't take me back to White Run. <laughs> I need to learn to save. Let's go into System. And let's go to Settings, Gameplay. Is there a way that I can change? Save character. Is there a way? How do I adjust this? So disabled. I need it on the lowest possible time. Okay. 
I'm just going to do a little time jump, and I'll see you guys back when we get back to those lovely uh, towers. See you guys then. Oh, thank goodness. I've been wandering alone for so long. I was kidnapped by these bandits. I managed to pick the lock and slip out while the guards slept, but now... Oh, thank you. They're at Mistwatch. Here. If you can stop them, you'll be a true hero. Okay, I just added that bit there in because that's a completely different bit there. I just added that little woman in. I'm not sure what she really did. I think she's updated my map. I don't really understand what she really did anyway. It was different to that guy being there. I thought Skyrim sort of stayed similar storyline, but obviously not. But I'm going to continue, do a little jump again, <laughs> and get back to our lovely time where we jumped off the bridge. See you then. Okay, everyone, we are now back here at this lovely area here, and let's see if we can take out these guys here. Be good if I could take them out without. My aim is obviously not that good because I'm used to being able to have the ability to zoom in. Oh, I've only got 28 hours left. These are not the best arrows anyway. Oh my god, how bad is my archery? It's horrendously bad. Can't even hit this guy. There you go, my lovely little underwear just crawling along there. Okay. Let's get up and run through and let's just quickly swap into our axe. And then we'll go through and sort through these chests in a moment once we've killed off all these enemy bandits. Ooh, hello. Ah! Ow, nice shot. Oh. Come on. Get out of my way, Ben. Come on, let me search you. I want this here and items strip her down because I want myself some lovely protection. Has that gone on me? No. Let's just quickly. Go ahead and save on one, four, three, just in case I die. And now let's go help Lydia before she gets. Oh, hello. Ow. This is from. Damn it. Oops. Where's he going? Where's he going? Where's he going? And crouch, please. Oh no, I do not mean that. I do not mean that, Dem. Mm. Yes, of course you fought worse than me because I'm not even in clothing. Okay, let's try this guy again. Of course I'm puny and weak. Look at look at my armor I've got on. Oops, oops, let me go, let me go. <laughs> run. <laughs> Ow. That was hot nice. I'm stuck at this game. <laughs> I just keep getting destroyed. Do I have anything else I can use? Like any fire things or let's let's try this stuff here. Please, I'm just gonna. Yeah, thank you for showing me to. No more. I yield. I yield. 
Oops, I don't want that. I want this here. That, that, that was easy using a flame. Okay, let's take that there from you, and let's take all this overly heavy armor, and then now let's equip that there. So I, th I think I'm going to start using this here now. Now let's equip that there, equip that there. Oh. I've s is that so have I still got all those heavy weapons on me then since I obviously went disenchanted them there okay so we've got all this stuff here oh, okay that's not too bad then I thought I'd lose them all but no I've still got them here okay let's continue cleaning, killing all these bandits since Lydia does a good job oh she's really taking out this guy here if Lydia is even still alive I'm not even sure if she is I wish I could run, that would be very helpful. Oh no, Lily's alive. Now you'll pee! Thank you, Lydia. Let's search this corpse while you take everything. This, this, is what I, this is all I do in this game. As I go ahead and I raid people's corpses to see what you can get. Where are you shooting from? Up there. Okay, let's go. let's go get you then. Come on, take them out, Lydia. Let's get our bones, see if we can at least take out someone. Pretty sure you can aim through here anyway. Let's go all the way up to the top. Oh, there's another chest here that we could raid. Ah. Ow. Come on, I can get you. Did I get you? Oh, beautiful shot. I love the slow motion this game puts into it. No, I don't mean to shoot. Let's take this cheese wedge and let's put this weapon. No, put this weapon away. The lovely slow motion. Okay, let's raid these chests here. Pretty, filled with gem, strength. We do not need that there. Got any potions or anything worth... Black arrow, let's ooh, archery increase that is perfect. Now let's go down here and quickly go through all these chests here. Is there something? Weight one, not worth anything. Alchemist table. And then get yeah, that's all I spend time is in this game is just going ahead and just going through and like checking if it's just taking everything I need. Because that's... I don't want to autosave. I don't even know what you're doing. Okay, let's continue ahead and hop out of this castle now. I'm just going to quickly go ahead and loot the rest of these people's bodies and take all these arrows and I'll be back with you guys in a lovely second. There we go. We have now finished raiding that area. It's got a bit of gold. A little bit of potions and there's dead deer here. Why is that? Why are they just randomly dead? Anyway, I just got a couple more potions and just did a couple bits of stew. So now let's continue getting over to this lovely town of Ivanstead. If, if that's how it's even said, as I'm going to repeat constantly during this lovely video. So let's go down the steep path through here and... I don't really follow the paths in Scrum. I normally just run over land, which takes twice as long. So that's why I'm going to get new experiences following these paths and see where it will lead us. And see if we've got any villages. So we have got ourselves a lovely mammoth place coming up. I'm pretty sure that's what they are, that little tusks up ahead. But I think we are going to continue up this way here. And I think that this should get us to the village. Hopefully that shouldn't take too long. And let's get ourselves our axe just in case we get ambushed again by some lovely wolves in the wilderness. Yep, I hear a wolf or something. knew there was a wolf coming. It was a little pissed. At least Lydia will take care of it, hopefully. 
So let's continue across and see this person up here. Hopefully they are not going to kill us. But I'm not sure which way to go to Ivanstead. Hopefully it's this way. Ivanstead, I Ivansgard. Nope, looks like we have to go up this way here by the looks of it. Assuming it's this way since that map didn't show us a different way. So let's run up all these steps here. Is that a wolf coming? Nope, she took care of that anyway. Let's climb up into this lovely mountain range here and see... Oh no, it's taking us to a um, little burial chamber thing. A tomb has been discovered. I'm not sure if I want to go in here. Oh yeah. Ah. Oh, that chime startled me. There's a necromancer around here, so watch yourself. Can you help me? He's in the tomb doing God know what with my dead relatives. Who's in the tomb? Val's Baron. My family has never really seen eye to eye with him. And he's finally gone off the deep end. He's gone in to defile our family tomb by using our ancestors for his filthy, dark elf necrop. My aunt went in after him, but she hasn't come out yet, and I don't think I can take him by myself. You let your aunt go in there by yourself? I don't have the time right now. You let your aunt go in there by yourself? I'm not proud of it. I'm terrified of that place, and Aunt Agnon... My dad locked me in there in a drunken rage when he left us. Three days in there eating the offerings left for our dead before Aunt Agna found me. Can you help me? He's in the tomb doing God's know what. what okay, let's way. go. I'll unlock the door and meet you inside. Then you can lead the way. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna steal this here. I'm gonna steal this bow meal. I'm gonna steal this salt and anything else I can steal. Salt and salt. There we go. So we have to protect this guy. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't guarantee you're gonna survive at all. Okay, let's head down. And let's just quickly let's a a a activate this quest here, so we know where we're exactly heading to. Whoa, didn't mean to jump forwards here, it's a bit weird. Come on, Draga. Let's take that there, because I am a Tomb Raider. There we go, anything else? Let's, let's just raid everything. Oops, let me get out of there. I'm not sure how you're supposed to unlock chests quickly. So this video is going to make our way. We might just take that there. Hey, those belong to my family. Okay, sorry. I won't, I won't take any of your stuff that belongs to your family then. Sorry about that. No. And Agna. Talos. Why didn't I go in with her? Yeah. Sorry. The door. Gods only know how he's defiling the bodies of my ancestors in there. Agna once told me there is a secret room deeper in, where they bury disgraced members of the family. Maybe that will get us into the main chamber. Okay, let's go then. <laughs> Sorry for touching the stuff, if any members. Let's go through this one. Ooh, you lovely beard. Oh, kitty, you're off. Any gold for me? Thank you. Where are you going? Oh, we've got to go through there. Okay, that makes sense. Be careful. No, oh, shut up, Lilia. And let's go through here, round here. You're alive. 
I don't understand if people can just walk through here and get through and just not wake up all these guys. Like, seriously, it makes no sense. Ow! Oh, I'm getting poisoned, that's why. Am I? This makes no sense, like, really? So look, this is highlighted, so that means we can search their body. This guy here is is a different colour, so that means he's gonna... Okay, they're quite helpful. Looks like he's gonna be a spider coming down. Yep, because there's spider webs everywhere. Come on, hop down. Why aren't you loading down for? Are you glitched up there or something? There we go, kill you off. Pretty easy, pretty simple killing off you giant spiders. Nope, don't need any of that, I don't think. I don't really know many uses for the venom. Got a guy, oh no, you're dead. Anyone else alive through here? Oops, I see that you're alive. Yep, you're alive. Oops, ow. Oops, sorry, sorry, Lydia. Didn't mean to do that. Oops, I'm just gonna go back here. And let's just quickly save this here before I get myself killed. Because it might be a bit of a problem. If I die. So let's kill off these druggers. Let's search this here, because you can you can never have enough gold in this game. And also enough arrows, you can always... Looks like the area Agner told me about. He said that the bear would show the way. The bear would show the way? Well, that's a bear to me, so... Oh, the bear would show the way. Okay, that makes sense. Passage goes through the sarcophagus. Better keep going. Bum tool, yep. Any of these gonna fall down on us? Hopefully not. Let's raid this body here. Damn you. Oh. I don't wanna accidentally kill this guy. So let's raid this here and I'm pretty sure everyone out there else raids these bodies. Okay, let's save this again since I hold up. Let's get in there and put an end to this. Attention, you may disturb the living, not the other way around. Oh, <laughs> what? Ow. You're a very, I don't know, what, what is this? You're like, teleporting somewhere. Oh, sorry, wrong person. What the heck? How are you coming back to life? That's not fair. Ow! That's, that's not fair. Okay, I'm gonna die here. I can tell you that I'm gonna die. Go away! How are you so powerful? Okay, let's take ourselves some potions of stamina and healing since I'm so pathetic at this. I don't think I've ever fought, fought this guy before.
Okay, let's just keep taking potions, because I am... Ah, uh, I don't mean to kill you. I'm gonna. Okay, I don't. I don't want. I don't want to kill that guy. I know. I know you probably shouldn't reload things, but I want to reload it. I don't want this guy to die. I don't even know what he does. He might help me do stuff. Let's just reload it like a, like a weakling. Expert. We should get after Bows there before he does more. Oh, what what's happening here? This is not good. What? Oh, I love it when you just fall through bits and pieces randomly. <laughs> Die! This is, I know this is painful to watch people. It is really painful. Anyway, let's scroll through this here and just appear back in. Oh, stop doing that. Sorry, didn't mean, to, didn't mean to hit you. Sorry, man. Okay, let's just take some potions of these things here. Let's randomly chuck them all in. Let's search this overlord. Okay, let's quickly see do we have a potion of Come on, let's kill you off. Come on, there we go. Good boy. Thank you for your help. Let's take all his stuff off of him. Wait, one, let's take that. Please take this and leave me to see to Thank you. And my other family members. It's okay. Ooh, 500 gold. Thank you. I have things I should see. What will you do now? To put my family here back to rest. Thank you. After that, probably just stick around here. Saw some good game on my way. Thanks again for your help. Goodbye. Okay. Now let's get out of here and let's try and finish getting our way to the lovely Greybeard. Bye, Aunt Agna. Okay, it was a bit of a side quest. Dying a couple times. 
proves how good I am at this game. Definitely proves how good I am, how often I will die. Anyway, anything? Anything in here? Hello! Come on, is there anything else that I can have? Lovely bodies stored in the wall there. Okay, let's quickly get out of here. Lydia, and let's quickly try and find where the lovely grey beds are. We... Ow. It's a little bit deadly, isn't it? A deadly spike. I suppose it's to prevent our tomb raiders from stealing stuff in there. Anything in here? Yeah, let's take all this stuff here. Who cares about their family? Come on, come on, come on, come on, load, you dead. Load, 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 load. There's so many chests outside this place, it's obviously not for this one. Anyway, let's try and make our way over to there, which we've got to pretty much go through this way here. Through the uncharted territory. Surely there's going to be a pathway leading there somewhere. Hopefully we will come across one soon. But at least our little calendar or marker or waypoint is now getting closer. So got a waterfall there. And we have got a bandit here. For some reason. Like it's just a random dead bandit. Okay, so how am I supposed to get across here alive? And yet I don't know why I can't jump, which is weird. Lily like, like I'm pretty sure X should make me jump, but it just doesn't let me jump. Oh, there's a chest here. Okay, I'm, I'm, I don't know why I'm so bad at lock, unlocking these. Right, how, how are you supposed to unlock these lockpicks? I unlocked those. Maybe it's just take my time. Let's take that there. Do I have enough room in my inventory? Not too much. Okay, so I'm assuming I'm just going to jump down across here and hope for the, hope for the best, pretty much. Let's see if I'm not going to die. Probably should really save the game again as well. But I'm not sure. Is, it, is that a goat? Are you a live goat? Yes, you are alive. Okay, anyway, let's just swim through this water. And there's a river. There's a thing there. Hopefully there's a road up here. Because roads are a lot more nicer to walk on than the wild. There must be kilometres and kilometres of roads in Skyrim. Just walking around and around. Got a little keep up here by the looks of it. A little army barracks, whatever you're supposed to call them. Got a cave to the left there, or to the right. I seem to be getting further away from this town, not getting closer to it. Here we go, this road looks a lot more promising. Heading straight up the hill there. Is it Ivanstead? I think it might be a faded sign, that's why it's a bit trickier to read. Let's try heading across here. And get meted by some lovely wolves. Hi wolves. Go away. Not nice to bite people. Is it going to take us up there if we go up this way? Hopefully it does. Now let's run up here and see where it leads us. I was constantly looking at this map, but it seems like we're just getting further and further away. So I need to head over that way there. Oh, is there something there? Nope, just the texture of the rock. Anyway, let's just try and fast speed up the travels here. Oh shoot, hang on, this is, uh... This is probably bad, this is probably bad, this is probably bad, this is probably bad, this is probably bad. 
Go away, Cyberkit. Go away, Cyberkit. Oh, very strong. Oh. oh, sorry, man. You, 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 you died. Sorry about that. Let's just, uh... Let's, let's just, ooh. Let's just... Sleeping Trace it. Let's just, uh... Let's just, uh... Borrow some of that stuff off your body. Thank you. Okay, let's get back to this village now. Ooh, there's a little glowing thing over here. And that is some lovely... Why can't I... I don't understand why I can't jump. Don't push me down river. Don't push me down river. It's not fair. Some neem root. Norm root? N Nern root. I'm not sure how you're supposed to say that, but we found one of them, which is pretty good. Okay, everyone, apparently we have got ourselves another form of a monster down here, which is great. Which is a troll by the looks of things. And I know how strong these guys are because I've had to face one before. Let's just get to a highish advantage point and try and see where he is. Let's, let's just let, let, let Lydia take all the damage. Good girl, Lydia. I don't understand why I can't jump. It's not fair. Where are you? I'll find you and I will snipe you. There we go. Hello. You heal so quick. Okay, let's get some magic on. I mean, let's get our axe on. And let's bring out ourselves some lovely fire. I'm pretty sure trolls are, trolls can't light fire. Do you like fire? No, you seem to... Holy shoot, you're strong. He's, I think I'm going to die. Oh, you're... you're... <laughs> You're very strong. Okay, bad boy, what am I gonna do? Okay, let's go items. As you can tell, I am horrible at playing this game. Staff of Fury, creatures up to level four attack. You think nearby? Let's just get this giant sword. Ah! I don't know what I'm meant to do. What am I meant to do, people? Because, um, like, nothing's working. Let's... Ugh! You're very strong. I know you're strong. No.
You're gonna kill me straight away. I'm not sure what to do. Ow, no, stop, it's not fear. I don't wanna die. <laughs> I'm just taking that for Oh, thank you, thank you, Liddy. I wanted to get it. Well, they give you no loot. Surely he's protecting something. It's just a little hole. Oh no. There's something here. There's another Nurn route. Really? Is there nothing here? Just a couple of skeleton bones. Nine gold. Come on, give me something better. A skull. Oops, a corpse. This has obviously got to be worth something. Let's read this note. There have been multiple complaints about attacks near the river northward of Rift. Of the Rift. We could need use some more civilian support for the area for the war effort. So send a few men to investigate. It's probably just a couple of wolves. So you only need to send at least, at most, two men. Happy hunting. Can I... Oh. Oh, it's a storm cloak. There we go. Anyway, well, he's dead. And there seems to be nothing else around. Okay, let's see if we can find ourselves that village. Oh, there we go. The village is loaded in. So let's fast track to that village. I'll be there. Oh, I'll see you guys once I get there. Here we go. We have now finally found it here. This is awesome. <laughs> I've instead, after many times of killing everyone, or getting killed myself, we have finally made it here, and I just heard them talking back here. So let's go talk to these people here. Hi, oh, yeah, how's it going? I wish I could make my deliveries more often, but the road's getting dangerous. Oh, yeah. Hi, Dick Willen. Anything I can tell you can tell me about Hi Hagen? Hi Hoga? I thought it was odd that there's a layer of thick clouds covering the peak of the mountain above the monastery. Huh. Not sure what's up there. But I bet the Greybeards know. You seem quite happy. My father taught me an important lesson many years ago. He said, Gwilin, you have the whole world before you. Go out and experience it. Be whatever you want to be. So I took his advice, and here I am. This life might not look like much to you, but I'm content. And isn't that all that matters? Now where's that older man gone? I'm meant to go talk to somewhere, so we've got to go visit the Greybeards up there. Hey, old man. You were talking about something before. What was it? 7,000 steps passing through on your way to High Hrothgar. About to make a delivery up there myself. What type of deliveries? Mostly food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. Oh, yeah. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Yeah. Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing... I could do it for you. Really? Well, that would... Here, take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. Okay. Let's do that there. Be careful up there. I wish oh, I could... anything else to watch well, out? Well, there's the occasional wolf pack or stray, but that's all I've ever had to deal with. Shouldn't be a problem. For Other than that, watch your footing. In these wintry conditions, the stairs can be treacherous. Thank you. So now let's quickly go ahead and let's bring the supplies to High Garden and let's start this quest here as well. So that is going to be the end of today's video of episode four on Skyrim. I was going to say Sky Sky Cave for some reason. We can see a bear over here. Probably not the best to uh, mangle or tangle with that there. This is where I'm going to end off today's episode, and we're going to start going up the 7,000 steps today. Come on, one step, two step, three step, four step, and what does this thing here do? Read. Okay, definitely read all that there. I'll go and read it at the end of the credits anyway, so pause if you want to see it. Okay, let's start going up here, and let's just quickly turn ourselves around. Thanks everyone for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Skyrim coming out soon is another Skyrim episode of not Skyrim 
Skycat episode, and we should be building and working on an iron farm, which I've already partly done anyway, but not recorded. So anyway, I'll see you guys next time in episode 5 of Skyrim. <laughs> Skyrim, Skycade sound very similar, but completely different games. The next time we should hopefully be up and with the green beds and that lovely aurora. So I'll see you guys next time, and thanks for watching. Let's cue that lovely outro.